Hello, welcome back to the ASMR challenge. Today's challenge will be, can you determine what it is I'm holding in my hand? If you can guess the object, you will win. Absolutely nothing. No, it is not in fact a cock, or a dick, or your tempo. Here's the object again. God damn it, none of you got it right. Once again, it is not my cock or dick. <laughs> it's a dollar bill. Guys, it's a dollar bill. How dare you? How dare you presume? What did we learn from George all those years ago? All you need is love. That's what we learned. It's gonna make it rain. Alright. Anyway, hello. Hello, hello. Hee hee hee. Let's jump right into a level. Um, before I actually jump into the level, I should probably just tell you guys, hi, uh, my name is Vinny, and I'm a memeaholic. Recovering. I no longer meme. I haven't said a meme in 15 years. Been been dry. Um, and also, uh, what was I going to say? Oh, I'm still sick. My throat is still kind of hurting a lot. So this is going to be more of a low-key stream again. So, uh, sorry about that. Whoever was expecting crazies, crazy stream. I, I don't have one of those for you today. So, um... Yeah, I guess that's about it. I know the website's down. I don't know why it's down. I don't really have... I'm not really like a... A web guy. So I, I wouldn't be able to tell you exactly. Um, sometimes it happens. Sometimes it just happens. I mean, the hosting is not something that is guaranteed to always be up, I suppose. You know, we're not like paying for the Taj Mahal of, of web servers. So anyway, we're back here at Shovel Knight. I've done four levels so far. Uh, and we're gonna do a few more tonight. I'm hoping to do this in maybe just a few streams. So maybe one more stream after this to wrap it up. So why am I playing Shovel Knight again? Well, it's because it's the Plague Doctor, the Plague Knight DLC, and I like the Plague Knight a lot. Plague Knight is one of my favorites, and um, it's it, it's like almost like a completely different game, to be honest. So I'm I'm really I'm digging this. Get it? Is that not your tempo? But yeah, it's gonna be more of a chill stream. I'm gonna try to just keep it somewhat low-key, if possible. Hopefully the game does not make me scream and, and rage. So, I'm gonna avoid raging and screaming.
a sec. I'm actually going to use a different... I try a different powder. I can't wait to go back into that lava. That was so cool. Right, there's the money. I need that even though I'm, I'm doing pretty well. I have more money in this game than I will ever have GMP in Metal Gear Solid. Whoa. I always spend my GMP on titty costumes. Just that, that helium and sand, man. I can't get enough of Snake's titties. Ah! I... I the reason I don't want to scream is because I don't want to aggravate my throat, because it's still... It's still shitty. Alright. Alright, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep it in check. I'm gonna keep it in check. No more screaming. No, no more getting angry. It's only platformers, man. Platformers are the games that get me the most... the most upset. They're the ones that make me feel. They make me feel the most things. Except for my... What's the word? I was gonna say tsundere. Japanese games, but I don't know if that's the way you pronounce it. Right off. Fuck right off you. There we go. Oh, what is this guy? I was trying to cheap him out. Easier said than cheaped. Alright, there we go. Yeah, again, if you're just joining us, the Vine Sauce main website is down. It is normal. These things do happen, Joby. Seriously, though. Our hosting has been known to go down from time to time. It's... It's fine. We're not, you know, I mean, sure, I'm paying for the hosting and everything, but I'm not, like... I'm not breaking the bank on it. I'm doing what needs to be done. But, um, I feel like if we... It could be any number of reasons. If they're hosting other gaming servers, they could be getting, you know, slowed down. There's a, a thousand hundred million reasons why the site could be down. Or Dyer could just be working on some stuff. So I'm not, I'm not really sure. Uh, so I'd like to recommend a documentary I saw while I was laying down earlier, just being a sick asshole. I watched a movie, or a documentary, by Penn & Teller, called Tim's... Tim's Veneer? Or Tim's Veneer? I don't think it's... I don't think it's spelled with an R. You fucker. God damn it. Vermeer. Wow, I, I got it wrong both times. It's it's Tim's Vermeer. Sorry. It's about um. It's about a guy who wants to rep replicate this famous famous painter from the 1600s, Vermeer, who basically was able to paint these really incredibly like photorealistic things that um just bl really blew people away and he's he's renowned as an amazing amazing artist but this dude Tim who's an inventor actually had this this idea that maybe Vermeer was doing something a little bit different maybe he was using some sort of device to get these photorealistic depictions that he could then paint directly using like a lens um, 
And that's exactly what happens. And you you get to watch a non-painter paint what is considered to be one of the, the most amazing paintings ever. It's it's a fascinating documentary. I highly recommend it. And it's it's Penn and Teller too, so you know they do a good job. They keep it entertaining. Camera obscura, correct. That is. The camera obscura is the name of the lens, is the name of the device that people have suspected Vermeer used. Anyway, I'm not even really into this kind of stuff generally, right? But it just something I was watching and, and I was blown away by it. So just recommended viewing. Photorealism does not equal good art. I, I don't disagree with you, uh, Kyle, Jen, Jen Trigger. Motherfuckers in my face, motherfuckers in space, motherfuckers in my ass, motherfuckers got gas. Um, yeah, if I sing a little song, that'll tempt me less to scream. Okay, good. Um, but the thing about the, the, like I said, just watch the documentary. If you don't think photorealism is good art, in the 1600s, it was unheard of to be able to draw this incredibly accurately. And and maybe the guy wasn't an amazing painter, considering a non-artist was able to duplicate his trick using, a, you know, some technology that he invented, or maybe rediscovered. But um, it is still a fascinating thing. And also the, the amount of patience. It took the guy 120 days to recreate this. And um, it's, yeah, it's really amazing. Um, I would say it's more the, the craft than necessarily the style that makes it interesting. It's, it's the amount of work, it's the amount of, um, it's the amount of life force that Vermeer probably put into his paintings that made them so incredibly perfect, I guess. I'm rattling on about this documentary, but yeah, I wouldn't, I wouldn't do that if it wasn't really good, so. Also, I'm not doing very good at this game. I need to step it up. Oh, come on! What do you mean? What do you mean? Oh, you floaty fucking bullshit jump bullshit. Fuck this. All right, no, I'm good. I'm happy. I'm enjoying the game. I also got to go back around the other way, too. It's great. Right back, right into the lava. This was not a good choice if I wanted to keep things chill tonight. <laughs> this is not a good choice of game for this. Decision, regret, immediate. I don't even think I could get most of my money back at this point. Like, I'm just... It's gone. Seriously, though, the, the, the floatiness of the jumps, it th it's throwing me off, man. From playing Mario Maker a bunch to this, yeah, I can't get those. I can get one, maybe, if I'm lucky. That's, that's it. I got, that's it. I can just get that one. Someone say vine sauce and chill. Is that a thing? Because I would imagine that would be like the very opposite of getting laid, you know? Um, hey, you want to come over to my house and watch vine sauce and chill? And then like 10 minutes into vine sauce and chill, all chances of any kind of action has just been completely eliminated from the night. Did he just say... Scrotum 
Like Toad Scrotum? Like the Mario Brothers character Scrotum? Is he talking about putting a frog condom on and fucking someone with a live frog? Because I don't like this guy and I, I think you should stop watching him or our relationship is over. Baby, it was just a prank, bro! Ah! there, Luigi. Slow down. Vinny, my brother walked in while you were talking about frog condoms. He is now confused. It's alright. It's good for... Uh, let, the, let the boy watch. Let the boy learn. Let him understand the ways of life. Do not prevent him. Do not prevent him from understanding. Mario Maker so good, why does this game have checkpoints, but that don't? Ooh, invulnerable. I can become invulnerable for a brief moment. I forgot I had some other relics. I have one that helps me uh, platform. I should be using that one more when I need it. Yeah. yeah, we could talk about frog condoms soon. Um, Joel, you can host Jen. I think, I don't know if Jen's streaming or anyone else is streaming, but I don't. I want to say thank you for hosting me. That's that's really nice of you, but um I mean, I'm doing okay. Maybe um if anyone else, I'm not sure the site's down, but if anyone else is streaming, maybe throw them a host instead. That's usually what I do. I'm the only one streaming? All right, never mind then. Fuck it. Carpe scrotum. Seize the dick. Much appreciated. Well, the team page still works. I checked that out a little earlier, but yeah, no one was streaming but you, so. Oh, right, the slime. I forgot about that.
That is ex essentially an extra jump. So I, I have to use that a little bit more. I, you get a little bit more freedom in the Plague Knight expansion. To, um... Kind of platform in many different ways. Vinny, are you planning on playing Happy Home Designer? No. No, 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 no. Part of the fun of Animal Crossing for me was... Most of the fun in Animal Crossing for me... Straight up comes down to the village and the, and the villagers and the freedom. I love the town. I love being able to, like, um... You know, manage my town and, and discover things. And, and die in lava. How about lava? You guys good on lava? So yeah, Happy Home Designer does not seem... Uh, look, I played a lot of New Leaf. I streamed a lot of New Leaf. And I have my Animal Crossing fix for a while. I want... I want a substantially different Animal Crossing. Or not substantially different. I wouldn't even say that, because that's... That's pretty much what we have now. Happy Home Designer is pretty goddamn different. I was gonna say, maybe a more improved, like a Wii U version, would be... would be really nice. But, um, yeah, I'll wait for the next iteration of Animal Crossing. I'm, I'm just gonna pass on Happy Home Designer. Plus, I get kind of bored of Animal Crossing games, like, after a little while. Uh, New Leaf lasted, I don't know, I, I guess four or five months. But, not even, actually. I wouldn't even say it lasted that. Maybe three months? Which, you know, that's pretty damn good for any game. But, uh, those, those games, they, you kind of run out of stuff to do. Like, like Tamadachi, you kind of just... There comes a point where there's just nothing new to see. And a game like that without any addictive qualities to its gameplay. I'm, I'm sure many of you would disagree, but that's my opinion. You need new stuff to keep you invested, right? So I feel like Animal Crossing is... I think a, a really good candidate for a kind of massively multiplayer experience with a lot of user-created content, right? I think that would work well for Animal Crossing. Maybe like a kind of, um... In some ways, like a Mario Maker kind of vibe to it. You know, like you can create your own areas or things for other people to explore. I mean, we already... Animal Crossing already has that. But maybe more so with, with an online community would would make me fall into lava again. Same checkpoint, too. That's cool. Uh-huh. This level is... busting my balls, guys. But my balls are officially busted. And let me tell you something. In this one case, busting does not make me feel good. How about lava? You guys good on lava? Shovel Knight got harder. This expansion is, is this or this update, whatever you want to call it. This this is 
It's kind of brutal at times, man. Are you on, on board for Fallout 4? I can't wait for Fallout 4. I'm excited. It, I just really need to finish Metal Gear Solid 5. Like a decent time ahead of Fallout 4, because those are both big games, big open world games, and, and I can't play too many of those in a row. But I am very, very hyped. I just today watched... Um, remember the original Skyrim announcement trailer? where Todd Howard demonstrated it, and there's a lot of applauding in the audience, a lot of cheering and stuff. I just watched that a little bit today, and I was like, oh man, I miss Skyrim. And then I was like, wait a minute, I didn't even finish Skyrim. And then I thought about it, I'm not going to finish Skyrim. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm excited for Fallout 4, because it, it, that's, that's going to be, I think that's going to be a lot of fun. See that mountain in the distance? You can climb it. There may be fuck all up there, but you can climb it. Skyrim is awful. People are saying Skyrim is awful. I don't. I don't think Skyrim is awful. Oblivion may have been a little bit better. Sure, I I, I like Oblivion more, but Skyrim was was good at, for you know. For what it was, it had a lot of really. It, it had everything that made Oblivion work. Minus some things, and it was more linear, which is a problem. But still, it was a good game. Well, that's just my opinion, man. Man. You're the demolitions expert. You're a day late. I'll just stand there. Start blasting. Hop to it. I'm afraid I'm not exactly here to help you with you. I'm not doing voice acting because, again, throat hurts. If I speak even at a louder tone, it's not good. So I'm just trying to stay as low as possible and just kind of speak as closely to the microphone as possible. I'm afraid I'm not exactly here to help you with your dig. I'm certainly here for demolitions. Boom. Should have known you were just going to clown around. Can't let... Whoa, can't let that happen on my watch. That's what happens when you drink seltzer on stream. Let's make this quick. Yeah, Skyrim and Oblivion, Morrowind, Daggerfall. What are you guys, stupid? What are you, all noobs? You like how that word is just now everywhere? Mainstream, just totally everywhere. Now, I prefer the adventure games. Remember those? The ones from, like, the what is it, the early 80s? Remember that shit where the dragon looked like a duck? That's what I'm talking about. Best gameplay, best quests, non-linear. Shit taste in games everyone has. Jesus, that was quick. That was a really quick fight, but really fucking intense. Vinny, I only seem to watch you live when I'm shitting. 
Thank you for sharing that, Dark City. I'm actually, I'm honored. I'm honored. I only seem to stream when I'm shitting from my mouth. We've got five essences. We're getting there. Let's relax and uh, let the dynamo decanter do its thing. <clears throat> but, but a watched pot never boils. Sure, but right now something else has caught my eye. This step takes concentration. We must drop the essence in. Why don't you come over here and help me unjam this lever? Oh, oh. This pivot seems to be stuck. It'll take two people to wrench it free. Come closer. Don't be shy. I'm right here. It won't budge. Put your hand over mine. Whoa. The forces of darkness reign no longer. For I, Percy, have fixed the power. How's it going? Eesh, that's a nasty stuck lever. Need a hoof with that? No? You're good? Fair enough. I'll be in the other room doing science. Well, so much for that. Uh, where were we before? Ah, uh, yes. The insufferable Namol Knight escaping that sweltering lost city had me dancing for joy. You dancing? I can't even imagine what that would look like. Yes, uh, preposterous. Health potion. So, right, 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 right. Wall climbing flames. Okay, 80 coins? No, oh, I don't have, I've only got 49 coins. Arcs into the air before it comes crashing down. Let's try that. That's pretty good. It goes a little too high for my tastes, but I think I could maybe fix that a little bit. And now I have a truly powerful weapon. Yeah, that works for me. Embrace those ass. your paper into my Jagon. What's this, what is this Truple stuff? I haven't... I don't remember if I even saw the Truple King yet. I'm sorry. Truple. Whatever. I forget how to fucking pronounce it. Who's awakened me, mortal? Does that need way to take alchemist? News of the villainy has reached the Truple Pond. Begun from the sacred grotto, but my liege, uh, I've actually come to learn the, the dance, you see. I can only sort of twitch. Enough! Disgraceful. Where is the motion? Where is the passion? Thou needs a miracle. Thou will receive the gift of rhythm, humble alchemist. As it so happens, we are miracle workers. No one is without hope. Places, everyone. Sorry, like I said tonight. Voice acting is very bad. Reading is bad, too. Alright, apple. It's a- it's an apple. It's a trout and an apple. Right, trapple. Uh-huh. I wonder if his name is, is Dave. And 
That's how it's done. A true dancer holds down to practice. I shall grant you my I-Cores, but only for a noble cause. Certainly, noble's my middle name. So require a nominal repentance fee for proper sanctification. Now, choose your i wisely. Half as much gold when you fall. Bounce off walls. Bomb jumping may be tough to control. Heavily plated when your footing is struck by enemies. But stopping may be a problem. Flashy armor that increases jubilance by 2,000%. Yeah, but that's just... It's jubilance. Two thousand... Two, I'm sorry, did I say two thousand percent? <laughs> sorry. Um... Yuck. Keep thy beak clean, plagued one. Return if hast thou hast further need of my blessings. Well, Plague Knight can dance now. You PC, bro? Yeah, PC UMass. How about you? Oh, I'm PC Ohio State, bro. Sweet! Yeah, this sucks. This bomb combination is not working very well. I'm gonna try to get used to it. Maybe I'll, I'll further learn how to make use of this, but for now... I'm not so happy with it. Though to be fair, it, it really takes out those knights nicely. So the gold is just for show. Like, there's really... Is there no other point to it? I mean, I increased in jubilance by about 2,000%, but aside from that... Ah, that's pretty good, that. Yep, I like that. Ah, I like that pretty good. Mm -hmm. It changes your jump and walk animations. I didn't even notice. Oh, the reason I didn't notice is because I'm in the fucking dark. But yes, my jubilance is up. Very much. I'll probably end up changing to the, the knockback ones at some point soon. Because uh, the knockback is, is what ends up really doing a fuckload of damage to me. You. No, fuck you! Fuck you! You! So, I'm so angry right now. <sighs> and that's why I need to get the knockback armor and not this gold shit. I'm lo I look like a decadent dandy.
Come on with your fucking knockback. AIDS dicks. No! Why am I playing this today? On the one day, I don't want to scream because I'm not feeling well. I end up playing a game that's making me scream. What a fucking life this is. I hate this level. I hate- I hate this level. I hate this armor. I hate skeletons. No, 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 Wesley Crusher, please, please, Wesley, let me show you what it means to be captain. Well, well, Wesley, for one. You must learn the meaning of patience, Wesley. I see the way you look at me, Wesley Crusher! I see the way you look at me! <sighs> Fuck your sparkly bullshit. Oh, because I entered a new area, all of my old treasure just went away. It just disappeared, guys. Like my dignity. Bob Law Blaws. Law blog. Well, Wesley, I should tell you that your mother and I have had extensive history. Someone in chat just made it, and it's gone. Joke. Well, there you go. Now you can. Nope. Nope. I have, I have the armor that I want, and I'm still, I'm still losing. I'm still losing all my stuff. I just suck at this game. I just suck at life. Nice relaxing night. Of Shovel Knight. Nice relaxing night. Just, just play some Shovel Knight. Not, you know, you don't need to see what you're doing. Cause fuck you. And that was it. It was just once the skeleton boss was destroyed. Where does this take me? Oh. Fire me into the armor outpost. Forget to carry the. Oh, perfect. Let's try again. It should be accurate within a centimeter. Just say the word.
Yeah, I still think I'm in the wrong spot. Is Plague Knight shy to dance in front of Mona? Yeah, he doesn't want to do it. He's shy. Who would have thought that at some point we would like this asshole? As much as I, I hate it happening, I really appreciate the losing money bit when you die. It actually makes losing a life or actually, you know, dying significant enough that you don't want to do it and not just like, oh, I'll just die over and over again until I get past this part. Really, really nice game design. I like it a lot. Meanwhile, Super Mario Maker, while a very different type of game overall, you die, and it's just, you know, whatever. Here's another hundred lives. Bob Loblaw's Law Blog. Bob Loblaw lobs law bombs. I'm not going to die on this level once. I'm going to get through this whole level without dying. Mark my words. Okay, maybe I'll die here, I don't know. God. Yeah. Yep. Alright, mark my words. See, I, I'm not- notice I'm not destroying the checkpoints because I have no confidence in any of the things I say. You guys ever watch that movie when the guy dies? Did you ever watch that movie? The 
disgrace that I feel. The, the dishonor. I feel like Worf through all of TNG. All of it. Goodbye, treasure. You'll be missed. Fuck ice levels. Fuck all ice levels. Yes, the website is down. No, I don't know what's causing it. These things happen sometimes. Are you ever going to collaborate with Critical soon? We have already. A few times. And uh, we, we have maybe a few others in mind. I did a Reign of Kings thing with Kryken. Just yesterday, actually, for a little bit. Though I'm not sure how that... I have it recorded locally. So I might put together a little video of our time being orphan children in Reign of Kings. Yeah, I think a CS Ghost stream would be nice, where me and him just kind of play some Counter Strike. I think uh, I think that's that's an order soon. I don't know. I'm generally not I'm not overly collaborative. I tend to enjoy streaming alone quite a bit. So it's you know, it's just kind of a, a special occasion thing, you know. But he is a very honest guy. He's critical is I've learned something about him. He's a very open dude. And he... You know, he's going through some shit, man. You know, believe it or not, people that make YouTube videos and stuff... And stream... Like, sometimes... I don't like to talk too much about my personal life any anymore. I, maybe I used to, but I don't really do that anymore because there's no point. Like I said, like, I'll mention a few things here and there. But, like, if something is is bothering me, I tend to just kind of keep it in. But, um, Crit is, I think, a little bit more open than I am. And that's, that's, that's his choice, you know? But, uh, believe it or not, shit, bad shit happens to everyone. And I think it's, it's how you deal with bad shit that defines you as a person. Not to get all philosophical. But I really believe that it's it's not about avoiding bad shit, it's about react your reaction to the bad shit. Fuck do you do this again?
Wh what is this? Oh, in I think the original Shovel Knight, you could ride those things. But maybe maybe Plague Knight can't. You gotta hit it with a shovel. <laughs> no wonder it doesn't work. I don't have a fucking shovel. God damn it, Plague Knight. It used to vomit rainbows. That's yeah, that's what it used to do. Fuck. Plague Knight is showing his lameness. Always bring a shovel wherever you go, kids. Shovel. Oh, I was reading the chat. I was reading the fucking chat. I thought for sure. That I, I wouldn't uh, fall into a pit if I was reading the chat. No way. No, I'm smarter than that, I said to myself. For the dude who said he liked my music, I just want to let you know I appreciate what you said, but at the same time, while I was reading your sentence, I, uh, I may have fallen into a pit. Knockback is actually way easier to deal with with this suit. I, I don't think I want to change this one for quite a while. This is... It just saved... You saw it just saved my ass, right? Like, without this particular suit, I would have... I would have been dead. Plague Knight's law bombs. He lobs bombs. His lawyer is named Bob Loblaw. I'm sorry, every time I see the lob bomb, I can't help but think of fucking Arrested Development. I really, really can't. I, I have to every time. Right, new relic time. Berserker's Brew. Damage enemies on contact without getting knocked back. Oh. How long does this last for? This is pretty amazing. Oh my god.
I'll use it once and then never again. <laughs> and here I am saying like, oh my god, it's the best thing I've ever used. Oh my fucking god. Oh shit, my pussy. Okay, my pussy cat. Yeah, for those who, uh, of you who were talking about my music in the chat, I actually have a new song up. Um, the Liana album actually had this idea. I'm gonna change the name of it. Yeah, I think I'm gonna change the name of it because that doesn't really fit the theme of the of the album at all So the new song room to breathe I think kind of Embodies the I guess what I'm going for Which is that it's like kind of my venting post So I'll probably just change the name of that and uh, give it some different cover art Also, it sounds cooler, too. I think the Liana name is a little bit specialized to people that know Game of Thrones and not much else. Room to breed. Yeah, sometimes I like to breed. We could plant a house, we could build a tree. Blah, 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 fuck this section right here. Who was around you written about? Oh no, my friend. Oh no. A magician never reveals his secrets. Alright, fine. It was written about Lyanna Stark. No. <laughs> no, it wasn't. Oh no, 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 buddy. I wrote it about Rev, alright? So that would be a good topic. Beck was very open about sea change. And that is arguably his best album. True. And Coldplay, Chris Martin was very open about their recent album being about Gwyneth Paltrow and the deterioration of their marriage. And that album is basically a whipped man asking for forgiveness. So no thanks. But, no, I just, you know, I don't, it's like, even if, even if I gave a name, even if it was two years ago, three years ago, even if the song was written yesterday, ultimately it wouldn't matter. Jesus, fuck! It's yours now. That's what, you know, you, you make music, and it's, when it's out of my hands and into your hands, it's yours, it's not mine anymore. Trying to let, I'm getting like half into this philosophical argument about music and half into getting salty about dying and it's like it, it, the combination of the two things is not working in, in tandem.
What advice would I give to a young man trying to teach himself guitar? I could be fully cynical and say if you don't have the passion to actually pick up the instrument every day, that you're not going to do it. I could also be cynical and say that if you don't have that passion to begin with, there's no point in even, even starting. Because whatever you do will be, suffer for lack of passion. And it'll just be like a machine. I could be cynical, I could say that. Instead, I'll say just pick up, learn how to read tab, and just, just play. Just play the music that you like, learn how to play some easy songs to your favorite bands. And uh, once you get those songs down, you either learn more songs and get better, or you watch YouTube tutorials on how to do more advanced stuff if you're trying to be a virtuoso, or you just really want to be fast at certain things on the guitar, or you could just write your own songs, or try to, and then eventually get good at it in three or four years. It's, it's up to you. It's, it's, it's really your path. The first and hardest thing is to, to work through the pain, I think, because the guitar actually... I think the, the guitar actually really hurts when you first start playing it, because your fingers are not calloused. And that shit hurts. And it almost ruined my motivation for it. So... I think, um... You know, you really gotta get through that first, like, two months. That's the hard part. And then once you learn how to do a few basic chords, E, A minor, A major, G, C, and once you get to F, if you can master the F chord, you can apply the F chord to anywhere on the fretboard. And you can do all sorts of neat stuff. So yeah, just work through the pain, get some calluses on your fingers, and... Hopefully, if you enjoy it, um, and you do play every day, you'll eventually get get really good, and you'll start to develop your own kind of style. Wow, I didn't realize I had such low health. Um, you'll start to develop your own style, or if you have a music teacher, you're de you'll develop a more traditional style. Either way is fine. That's up to you, again. And, uh, that's kind of really it, I think. I don't know. Um, I, giving guitar advice while playing video games. I guess there's more, but that's, that's as much as I can think of right now. I wish you luck. I, I think motherfuckers should go to space on a trash ship. Motherfuckers should go to space in orbit. And that way all the trash gets sent to outer space. And we don't have to deal with it here on Earth. How's that sound? Is that good advice? I, I hate losing that much money to a stupid death like that. It's... it... Oh, it's horrible. Someone mentioned, is bass guitar harder or easier? Um, I don't know, actually. I, I, some people say it's easier because you only have to play one, one string at a time, as opposed to six on a guitar. Or, you know, not six, but like you have to do chords on a guitar, and... You have to kind of figure out all these tricks, and, and the bass is just, well, get good at one thing and then do it really, really well. But I also think that being a bassist is very tricky. Because trying to sound like a bassist on the bass is a lot harder than it just than it sounds. You have to complement the drums. You have to bridge the gap between the drums and the guitar. That's that's one of the ways I see the role of a bassist. You don't want to do too much, but you don't want to do too little either. I mean, you can depending on the song. But, um, it takes a few years to learn either instrument well enough to maybe join a band, I think. I guess it also depends on what, what do you listen to most when you listen to a song. 
If you listen to dance music and you like bass, maybe try bass guitar. If you listen to, if you listen to like um, hip hop and you listen to the bass lines, try bass guitar. You know. But if you listen to rock music and you like the the, the guitar, you like the the melodies, then pick up guitar. I, the way I see it is, okay, if you're more of a rhythmic person, try bass. If you're more of a melodic person, if the melodies in a song appeal to you more and stick with you, and that's what you want to do, then then try guitar. So, that's, that's kind of just some general music stuff, if you're interested. Alright, let's get back to the game. Boom. He he he. <laughs> so much, so much emotion in my reading tonight. <sighs> hey, hey, beard knight. You got a little something in your ears, weakling. Like we figured out why I'm here. Yes, I need something that you have. You know, I never liked you, wizard. Masks, books, cheap tricks. You're nothing but a weakling. How grumpy. Let's settle this with a snowball fight. That doesn't do nearly as much damage. Oh, I forgot this dude. This dude does some scary shit to the level. He he makes spikes happen. Oh, Jesus, fuck. Jesus. Icicles I see in your mask. Are you all right? What happened? Polar night happened, and I wouldn't mind tropical beach getaway right now, Mona. Perhaps when all this is over. But let's focus. We're almost ready. So, what are we working on? I'm one coin short. No, I'm not. Well, hang on. Before I use it here... I'm curious about something. I know there was another... guys here again. Um, at the armor outpost, no? Long may his stem grow. Wasn't there something that you needed um, green coins for here, or, or no? Sheet music? No, not at all. Nope. Loaded with deals that'll blow you away. Here we go. Um, holds up to 10 health tonics. Oh, I can't really afford that, right? I can, but I'm gonna hold off. I already did it. It was the catapult dude, right? This is all getting too risky. I can't lose him. I'll reward you however you want. Just do this for me. Why would you help that miserable lunatic seize power and beguile the Magicist? What's in it for you? Magicist? Are you kidding me? You're just trying to talk up your asking price. Then there's the other matter. I can't be bought at any price. What are you doing? What are you two doing here? So the Magicist, huh? What about her? Is she okay? Let me ask you something, Plague Knight. Where do I fit in? Your big plans. Are we partners? Are we more? 
Wait, I, 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 I... Look at him. B -b 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 busted C -c 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 Can't even formulate a response! <laughs> what a wimp. This whole time I thought we were in this together. Was I just a tool to you? I need some time to think about all this. Wow. What was her problem? Lest you think your problems end here, you continue to threaten the Enchantress. Prepare to taste steel. Steel! That works. Mona? Hey, where'd she run off to? Oh, Mo Woo! Percy on deck! Love riding that thing. Hey, Mona was in a hurry. Gathered some things and took off. She ill? No matter, rain or shine, Percy will fill in as needed. She really gone? Mona's notes are pretty thorough. Looks like I'll require 80 cipher coins. Now simply watch as Percy dazzles you with engineering precision. <laughs> Incredible, we've done all the research in Mona's notebook. Actually, something scribbled on the margin. It seems impossible, even if we collected every last cipher coin. But enough hypotheticals. I present to you your full arsenal! Boomerangs back and forth, pulses damage, damaging sparks, but the case is harmless. Explodes on contact. Cannonball through enemies and cut them all down. Some pretty good stuff. Let's press that button for no reason. Oops. Oh wow, these actually go straight ahead. That's pretty good. They they That's pretty cool. No, Percy, we're not done yet. Uh, I'm a little short. Watch me, Nay Nay. Watch me, Nay Nay. Please look at me and watch me, Nay Nay. Oh god, it's, it is the actual spin attack. Are you fast enough to get by in time?
Probably not. Why is that? What is the Nene? Why is it a thing? Why? Why did people make the Nene a thing? I need an item. I need the fleet potion. Oh, so you know what? I'm gonna get the fuck out of here. Is what I'm gonna do. I can't get the fuck out of here. Bullshit. Yeah. Tells your exploits have reached far and wide. Hmm, really? Who are you? An interested party. We seek to find the bravest fighters and test them. What, by rubbing your shoes in the carpet and poking them? Got places to be. And prove your worth. I like this weapon combination a lot. I, I could see myself really, really enjoying this. God damn it. Get, move faster. There we go. See, book knowledge will never replace swordsmanship. Despite your sizable arsenal, I was still able to land many strikes. One should never underestimate even the lowliest enemy. I shall leave you with that thought. I wonder if people can tell when I roll my eyes under this mask. Yay! I want to go back and get the item I missed, which I believe was in the Explodatorium. Can anyone confirm? Sparkle bombs with impact Rex bosses. She slapped. So what level did I miss my, uh, my item in? I got the vat in the Explodatorium. Okay, so what level was it? Does anyone remember?
It might have been Treasure Knight. The vat is in the Iron Whale. Oh, okay. The Staff of Surging, as the Explodatorium has that. I've got the Staff of Surging. Well, here's what I have and what I don't have. Or did I get everything so far? Fleet Flask is in Tinker Knight stage. No, I got the Ice level. I have everything so far? Oh, okay. Alright, I thought I missed something in, in a previous level, I guess not. I want to check out this combination. Seems pretty good so far. Jesus. Yeah, because the sparkle isn't supposed to explode, but with, with the impact casing, it explodes. They're pretty good. I'll do one more level. Oh god. Visions of Mario Maker are filling my head. And then my next stream... I'll be able to do all the secret stuff and the final level as well as propeller night stage so that that should probably I think that that pretty much spaces the stream out almost perfectly now that I think about it the first one was probably longer than, than these two will be but yeah I forgot how good the music was in this game. Try that combo with the regular case. It just explodes fast. Esther! Didn't look like it was gonna make it. I wonder if if they made a Shovel Knight 64. Like I know the the devs when I interviewed um, them. We're talking about, you know, it was a joke, but it also was kind of like everyone agreed it was a good idea. But what if they made Shovel Knight 64? Right? That was the joke. Shovel Knight 64. What I'm wondering 
is, will Nintendo somehow find a way to get infringed? Like, you can't uh, say that a game is a 64 game unless you're specifically licensed by Nintendo for the, that's, the 64 is our infringement. I mean, there's no way you could, you could lay ownership, right? To a fucking, to a number? Like, there, there's no way. I, I'm just, obviously... I need that. Yeah, fuck. Whew. God damn it. Fucker again. I see what I was doing wrong. I did go this way already. Um, I'm a fucking decadent dandy. And I'm, I'm an almost dead decadent dandy, too. It's a good thing I have a constitution of steel, because the, the stupid shit that I do, you guys have some really, really valid criticisms of the way I play games sometimes.
aren't music pages usually at dead ends? I thought this was the way I had to go. Oh, there's a ladder. Alright, flying dick rockets are here now. Did you see the skill that, that I just pulled off accidentally? Fuck yeah. Explode into a frenzied dash. Okay, this is the one that makes me fast. crash into a wall, you lose the uh, effect. No trouble. I don't want no trouble. How did I live? How did I live just now? <laughs> I was still in Sonic mode. I was still in Sonic mode. Oh, my throat hurts. Ow. Ow. Fuck. I went left to try to get the things that I missed. That's why I went back left. I was still in fucking supersonic mode. And ruined all of that awesomeness that was happening. Okay, so here's the here's the deal, guys. Here's the deal, guys. I just learned something new today, okay? I learned that if you're in supersonic mode and you jump around and you do all your activities, you stay in supersonic mode, okay? I just learned this just now. That scream. Oh, that scream. That was not a good idea. That was so not a good idea. I didn't I didn't need any money in this game anyway. I didn't I didn't really think it was a good idea to have money at all. Actually, I didn't think it would, they needed it. The worst part of these games, or games like this, is when you die a bunch of times at one spot and you just try to rush to get through the level because you're sick of playing the same fucking section over and over again. And as a result, you just die more.
All that for 350. Like, I, I died over there so many times for 350 coins. I'm gonna need some, uh, I'm gonna need a cough drop. One second. Yeah, I'm not- I'm not speeding along my recovery by screaming at Shovel Knight. Maybe when Metal Gear comes to- comes to be. Maybe when Metal Gear 5 comes to, I won't have to scream at all. Maybe- maybe I- I can repress these instinct- instinctual activities that happen when I stream video games live. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. So people were telling me to, um, use the double jump after the jump effect, after the screw attack thing. That it works! It works a little too well, though. Watch. You get some good distance, but you're then fucking impossible to, to control. Go real fast. You're not impossible to control. Obviously, I'm I'm exaggerating, but it's still, yeah, 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 chilly.
Oh, look, it's Plague Knight. I heard you might show up. Why have you come here? Uh, the esteemed inventor, I do so respect your craft. Relinquish your essence and it won't be harmed. What? I don't think so, bird mask. You have your own brain. Use it or lose it. Oh, you do get two two bursts if you do this properly, yeah. Wow, this combination is a fucking boss killer. Yeah, that, that was piss easy. That was piss easy with this weapon combination. Really good, really good combination for defeating bosses. Oh, no, Tinker Knight. You know how you out much. I got a cough drop in my mouth. I can't talk. Yes, I asked nicely, but he was too stubborn. Only one more essence required. Muscle butt. Big, big muscle butt. There he is. Baz. Hey boss, you swiped these potions from the Magistus when she wasn't looking. Shouldn't have to pay for these, right? Here, take them. Thanks. Thanks, muscle butt. Show feats. Next time, next time on Shovel Knight, I'll do all the things you guys want me to do. Spend money, um, get do the music thing, and beat the game. But for now, I'm going to take a few minutes, and I'm going to switch to Metal Gear Solid 5. So hang tight for just a few minutes and we'll just talk about some vocal parasites and we'll check out this new bit rate that I'm using and, and see if I can if I can handle it see if snake can handle it be right back <laughs> 